Tony went up. Oh, no, 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 no. Yo, what's going on, everybody? Riot's here back with another episode of Ark, but everything's five times bigger. Oh, my God. I just spent, like, five minutes clearing everything out of the way so I could get out of here. And then this dude, the freaking beta male from last episode. Oh, he's just permanently stuck here because trees and rocks have grown around him. Oh, my God. It's, you guys don't understand how long I've been trying to get out of this freaking base in my Perlovia, dude. This has been crazy. Like, there's... We need to make straight up half of this map our base. I guess the bases need to be five times bigger, too. Oh, breathing room. Holy Jesus Christ. It's amazing. Look at Crisco. He tried going up over the rock right there. And now he's going to be stuck there for the next 37,000 years. Rookie move, bro. All right. So, welcome to another episode of Ark, but everything's five times bigger. Today, we finally have our egg farm ready to go tame some Titan boas it's gonna be freaking awesome because i mean like that's like the whole advantage of everything being five times bigger is you have giant snakes on the map i feel like that's what i've been most excited for like that wyverns the reapers the elementals the freaking i guess the manticore the the indom on the way i guess i'm excited for a bunch of stuff it's gonna be sweet though and this is starting to just look pretty freaking adorable to me i think he just stays like that like mid stasis chart oh either way dude bruiser is like my favorite creature so far all right well we're looking pretty freaking sexy at this point in the survival series i think so too man i think a giant perlovia is cool but i'd honestly be scared to death a giant hog might be able to destroy a city like a regular sized hog can kill a man so that right there could kill an ultra man that is true the freaking muscle and he jumps and he jumps i was just talking to somebody yesterday who lost two fingers freaking boar hunting so now i'm just like a giant one of those and just eat cities bro It'd oh be a yeah you don't, yeah yeah don't don't mess with boars dude they're crazy man okay so you know how you said you added the roman mod because it like provides us all that fancy scorched earth stuff yep i freaking crafted one of these things that i swear to god was not in here during our last survival series and it is glorious as all hell what is it you might need to move your pig a little more over by the Perlovia. Okay. Try to place the structure right here, and it's a big, fat, juicy one. Ooh, the weird, weird description. Look at this, though. Straight up, make oh. little Roman-like town centers now. Wait a minute. That one's way bigger than the last one. Yeah, they've upgraded it like crazy. I only made one door because I didn't even know what was going on here. So this bedroom, yeah, I guess just pick whichever one you want. But it's like, we have our own little freaking compound now. It's awesome. Dude, this is amazing. Right? I like, like this one. Oh, look at those little tables. Too? Well, <laughs> there's tables for regular sized dinos. <laughs> oh, that is cool. It's got built in stables. Yeah, damn it. If only that it wasn't a series where everything's got that. Honestly, realistically, anything could walk over our walls in this, but it's like a pretty semi peaceful part of the map. Oh my god. <laughs> I was so hyped about this. It's so funny that usually this would provide so much like security. Like, I'd be like, we're safe. We're freaking, but like anything necessarily could walk over that wall right there well we pretty much have to build like giant gates look at me like look at the attack pose it'd be like a kaiju animal know, look at this. <laughs> oh yeah look if you get stuck frozen it's, yeah it's essentially a giant pig cage is what we made but families could live here too okay so i'm just testing the roman things i'm sweating my balls off still i am actively sweating mine balls off but i do have a little home insulation thing but it's like i just necessarily i think it may be 100 percent up to i i guess it's just because it's a heat time it's a specific like no matter what you'd have to have the ac blasting right now or you'd just be freaking just destroyed oh is it not protecting you from the heat it's it's sort of but it's not it's still pretty viciously hot also, one thing, well, I guess we were getting called out a little bit because of our Morellatops confusion at the beginning of the episode where we thought they were, like, tamed by some enemy. A, a, a few people said they were babies that wandered off and, like, grew up, but that still confuses me because we had never bred any yet in the survival series before. So, I don't know, a lot of people thought we were just silly, but I swear to God, like, we, we, we rattled our heads off camera for, like, 15 minutes. There's no reason those things should have been there. Yeah, I actually thought, like, there was a tribe on the server. I'm still, like, legitimately convinced it's witchcraft. We're not a couple of idiots who would just walk up on our own mistake like that. Like, it, it's a mystery. All right, dude, let's go tame some giant snakes. Dude, 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 snakes. Let's go here. I'm going to... I think I'm going to go snake. on foot because everything is so, like, deady outside. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, also, Maybe. I'm pretty sure I'm stupid. I thought it would be, like, a thousand eggs, but I went out and looked at a few boas earlier, and it just says, like, two to four eggs for most of them, so... 
Yeah, I don't think that would change because it has to do with eating it. It might not even eat that many. Yeah, yeah, it might be like completely different from taming. It's just, I guess, we didn't need a giant breeding farm whatsoever. This is just oh. a complete total waste of time, but at least like we got it going on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay, one thing we also really need to find a freaking oh. thing to get you a witch's hat because with like it being Halloween, I feel like the, I feel weird being the only one with a witch's hat. Oh! It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. These bugs, these bugs are like bugged as shit after like the new recent arc date. They, all they could really do to us until like they, they push out their new update to the dev kit and modders can fix stuff. All they could really do is bug us. They can't really attack. Oh, they're just bugging us. That's it's amazing. It's super ironic. Yeah, oh my God. The irony kills me inside right there. But I think our best chance is just to run away from this thing because it probably is also... Yeah, it's gonna take me a million spears to get through this thing. Okay, the little dude is stuck in my bosom. Yeah, he's like, just chopped away. Oh my god, go get a creature or something. What are you just standing there for? I'm gonna get a creature right now. He is just really nuzzled up in there. This dude is about, he is 1000% dead. Let's see if you get for you to bail. All right, you get eaten by bugs, damn it. We gotta get rid of this thing. See, like, currently with the bug, they're, they're freaking harmless to people, but still super deadly to creatures. Hey, where's this bug at? I don't know, man. He's out here somewhere. I think I'm fairly certain he's biting my ass right now. He is. He went inside. All right. The culprit. Oh, my God. He's not even over yet. He has such an advantage because Ark is so derpy with hit marker stuff. So if something's got a derpy hit marker, then it's virtually impossible to kill when everything's buggy. There. He's dead. Uh, he's fallen. All right. So the great insect of the north no longer has claim over this region. Bugs, dude. I think Oof. it might actually bring the saber. There's a lot of malarkey going on out here. Yeah. So probably where we were going before. Oh, there you are. Okay, good. Oh, my Damn. God. I just got an extreme case of the shits. All right. Oh, God. All right, so let's uh, this go this way. This way right here, yeah, exactly. Exact the mundo, bud. Oh, we need a freaking galley so we can get that double saddle loving going. Oh, dude, we need the galley. You're right. Hey, this is direction the moth blue. Oh, yeah, you tamed a moth that just like flew away, didn't you? Yeah, it, it, I, got, I was like, uh, do my intro. I was like, oh, look at this. Man. The moth was just stuck. It's a Bugged special out. kind of love when they just like run away forever instantly you know what I'm saying? instantly like he was done with me now that's love damn it oh snap so i got some primitive dino candy corn Woo oh nice i don't even remember what the hell i'm supposed to do with that i'm running around to various candy corn things trying to get you a witch hat oh man i need a witch hat bad all right here, here we go um i am Dude, almost to those bad. spiky rocks all right, cool. I'll meet you at those spiky rocks momentarily. But it is Halloween. Come on, witch hat. Seriously? I'm getting stingy with it. I've got every kind of meat from, like, steak to your mother's bosom. But I don't have a witch's hat. Oh, there you are right in front of me. You've got commies in your tail. Oh, do I? Let me turn around and grab them. I'm just going to run past them. Okay. Can't deal with every communist nowadays. Man, my dude just so happy with a little tail. This is a sketchy place to get out and acquire some freaking candy corns. But a man's gotta do. Uh, oh, Burke, but a man's gotta do. Oh, Snapple, son. I got a bunch of awesome freaking various kinds of candy corns, but. Oof, you're by. Hey, careful, dude. You're actually you have a buttload of health. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm right. This thing is a hell of a beefcake. Yeah, and he'll heal pretty quick, too. This guy heals. I'll follow you into battle then, buddy. Even though my audio feels so derpy through my headphones right now, I can't hear anything. I mean, through my beanie. It's so thick. These guys are in a ball. This fight's going to go on for decades. I'm going to go find I'm some candy corns and snakes. <laughs> All right, yeah, I'm, I'm going to go with you. All right, here's a snake. Level 100. God damn it. I will kill you, you bastard. Right. I made it to the open desert. 283 something. Huh. Oh, there's, there's a bunch of snakes. Yeah, but I'm trying to find a super duper high level epic sexy one. And yeah, none of these yeah. guys get my goat going. There's like the sexiest freaking creature. I mean, the sexiest color boas. And then it's just this plant. Go ahead and pop out of there, little guy. One of the bugs Arcus had recently. Oh my god, the deathworms grew a little. Did they? I can't tell. Actually, those sting like shit. 
See, he's level one also. The death worm is suffering from the same bug that those Morelotops were suffering from. It's not just us. Please die. Please die. I need your body parts. You fight Manticore. Damn it! Damn it, damn it! Die, Foul Spectre! Alright. I'm looking for you. I have defeated the almighty death worm and gathered its horn of justice. Nice. Huzzah! Wait, so I, n I honestly don't even remember what to use this dino candy cord for. Has a curious effect when consumed by a dinosaur. Movement speed plus 10%. And then it seems to change the coloring regions. And then each one has different coloring. Well, I'm certainly not trying it out on the most gorgeous saber. Get out of here, bird! He wants my love somehow, and I can't... I think, honestly... <laughs> Damn it, bird! I'm pretty sure you knocked him out. I just didn't spoil me. Shit, 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 shit. I did not know this is passive. I did not realize, however, that, um, that, that they damaged me. I thought he was just damaging my freaking creature. I didn't know I was taking a pound. I go, butt naked in the desert now. Okay, I'm running home and I'm getting this bear change of clothes. So I'm like, Sick sandstorm kicks in, then I die of thirsty. Hell no. Nah. Okay, one more crack at this. No, 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 no. Oh, I thought the fall damage was gonna get me. Oh my God, what is there? Just like a freaking witch drought going on around here. I hate how weak I am. Damn it! Damn it to hell! Like I'm gonna charge out there and I'm gonna freaking die, bro. That's that's what's in the clouds for me. Like if anyone could handle the the rough terrain of being out there on his own though at Starth Mall, you got this, buddy. Vultures just stole my snake. Vultures stole your snake? Yeah. You know what mod I'd consider actually a, a sponsoring is a uh, pet parachutes. Pet parachute sounds amazing. I feel like pet parachutes just hop bar activated when you're on your pet and then poof, just this big, <laughs> this big saber parachute carrying you along. Kind of criminal, we don't already have pet parachutes. Okay, this 520 snake seems like he's just the most precious muchacho. Oh, it's two 520s. Hey, 8657 if you want to crack at some Thick muchachos. Snakes don't seem to aggro. Yeah, there they go. There they go. There they go. There they go. Run, stupid! No! You must be right ahead of me. Like oh, right there we go. The, the, the snake right to your right. These are both 520s. All right, perfect, perfect. Um, then I'm gonna drop an egg. I feel like I'm definitely doing this thing correctly. I want to look it up on the Pedia because I feel like an EB right now. But like I have like but delicate loved ones in front. I feel like we've all been in this situation where you don't want to lose your tames. But the thing is, these snakes are freaking huge and they travel like a thousand times faster than a man runs. And they do a lot of torpor. I'm pretty sure on foot this just simply will not work out. Okay, so due to a bunch of malarkey poop, uh, basically just because like standard things of trying to drop eggs near the Titanoboa and get it to eat it without it aggroing is a little more annoying when the serpent is like the size of a small town, so... Hey, there's a 580 on Mantra right here. I'm definitely not going for no 580. Okay, this one's an 80. Now that one's more my kind of, my kind of character right there. I guess as long as it can carry the freaking eggs, I see something I can drop eggs right down on it and then I won't care if it dies. Yeah. I'm big on the not caring if something dies. That's like my main selling point with a loved one. Oh my god, this freaking dead horse just on the side. This is like the most brutal... Am I alone here? Look at the way its leg is just drooped over. That's terrifying as all hell. Oh my god. It looks like it was placed there by oh my god. Like <laughs> I wish, I wish we could tame these oil bugs. I got another trap for Mantra. Nice! I guess I should just settle for one at this point, huh? It's hard to settle for love. You got one? Yeah. Nice! I them and everything. Woo! Dude, this one better not fly away. Awesome, 540, what's up, what's up with all the big shots around here? This one's kind of a loser. I could roll with this one. Oh my yeah. god, please tell me for the love of god. I... Ah, I, I, I repaired my rifle and I forgot to get it out. I, I, I might kick myself in the nuts. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, freeze, you giant bastard. Well, that was just infinitely short. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god. Nice, brother. I was robbed and I, I didn't even read of what. 
Okay, now I'm back. This is my darts. That's all that matters. What's going on, you handsome bastard? Thinking about not going home with me? Think again! Oh, he's definitely going to be thinking about not going home with me in a minute because he is getting free, but I will take my best shot at this giant gorgeous creature. I imagine it's such an incredible pain in the ass to track these things right after that bowler runs out. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, that was malarkey, and you know it. You know that was malarkey. I guess it's this one. Let's just try to keep an eye on this one. All right, I got you. I got you. Not going anywhere, buddy. I'll eat everything if I have to. Oof. What's... Did you... Hey, what's happening? I think you lost your... <laughs> I think you lost your mouth there, bud. I'm no rocket scientist or anything, but I'm just a simple farmer, but I'm pretty sure that your moth just got eaten by a raptor. Did that one at least hit? Did that one at least have the common decency of registering? It didn't. Oh my god, you dirty bastard. Oh, come on! How am I gonna figure out what, 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 how do I even... Oh my god! Every time I feel like it's gonna be a, a, a good one. A good... He's flying at supersonic speeds! Yeah, he's got away. He'll, he'll land, I promise. And oh, goody, aggro to terror bird. Fantastic. Fantastic. Oh, yeah, they're, they're special. Get off that moth, you bastards. I did him. God, this saber is the toughest muchacho on this side of the Mississippi. I'm gonna get you. Wah! Wow, I was not a yelled waff. I was not positive about that one. Oh my god, 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 why isn't it able to attack on so what's going on here, buddy? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. You dirty rat faced bastard! This creature can only take so much abuse out here. Dad, you really wanna go out here into the into the wilderness? You think you're built for this, you stupid moth? You're gonna die. We're all gonna die out here on this goose chase. This is insanity. Because these suckers fly forever. Oh my god, it's set down. Holy mother of balls. Alright, I'm just gonna have to follow me. I'm gonna get back to base. You can crap at me all you want, little person. I'm still gonna shoot you full of tranquilizers. That crap is mighty effective, though. Kudos to you on the dookie. You're going down, bud. You're going down to Chinatown. All the other dirt bags like yourselves. Like, like, you're going to jail, but I'm just gonna keep training them all I can. I don't care about the stacking. You're going down, punk! I mean, even if he, if he, oh, no, it'll go down. Okay, okay. Whew. That was a close one. Obviously, he would prefer mayo berry more, but like, sometimes you just gotta get the dude out of here. Oh my god, we've done it! I wonder if I'm gonna be able to freaking get this guy back to the base for a saddle. I wonder if he'll just. Honestly, be maybe safer here. There's like nothing around, but there's so many terror birds around here. Yeah, just follow me, little buddy. Follow me to safety. Oh, wow. All right. Go ahead and craft up two saddles. Yep. Because I'm about to be there, baby. Yeah, we got some flying abilities now. So I'm talking about a uh, giant moths. I don't know if I'm cool to name this one Mothra, to be honest. Like, I'd rather name a mega powerful one Mothra. This one's more Moth, moth Taxi. We're almost home free. Come on, little buddy. I can't believe it's- I can't believe it's finally happened! I can't believe they finally sat down. I really thought he was gonna fly around in circles till, like, the sun burnt out and humanity was destroyed. But no! Oh my god, these things are so fast. Just go ahead and sit right there, buddy. Just go ahead and pop a squat. No, where are you going? Just go ahead. Any- any spot will do. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you know, just, 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 just... Whoopsie doodles! Don't want everything in there follow- Okay, no, okay. Seems to be going fine. Okay, it seems... Be on five. This is yours right there. What's going on, buddy? Yeah, here we go. I just made a saddle right here. Shoot. Oh. It's cool. Ooh, now we have an extra for her. Alright, sweet! Drop some more of the weights of the old berries. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Woo! Oh my god, your Anki's big fat ass. Okay, I gotta pass this. Alright. Time for attempt number two at taming giant snakes. Which usually I understand could e even be done on foot, but like I I can't stress this enough. They they are very fast. The snakes when they're five times bigger, they their hit range or their hit range alone, you won't stand a chance. Dude, these things are the fastest things on the planet. 
They are, aren't they? These are amazing. I guess everything's five times more stat boost, so they fly five times faster. I can't even get into the freaking ring. No wonder they had such a hard time like being tamed. Okay, if I angle it right now, it's a straightaway, right? Oh my god! All right, you guys ready to go fail at something epic with style? Honestly, just hovering above Titan of Boas. Like, to be honest with you guys, oh, I guess we should have just gone for Argents. What the hell were we? I guess these are actually more adorable and a more logical next step in our survival line. But yeah, we actually haven't tamed like Titan of Boas since they were updated and able to be tamed. So we're just kind of going off the advice of like subscribers in our communities right now. And um, yeah. The, all, the, all the advice makes perfect sense. It's more just like our lack of uh, preparation being this early in a survival series. It's kind of halting us. Now, if I could just kind of angle this dude over this snake over here, everything will be totally kimosabi. Just chill, little buddy. You slithery, evil little serpent monster of the night. Okay, so we've been trying to get this working for like 20 freaking minutes now. We've got multiple crazy PvP and PvE legends and arc both saying that if it's still not working with all the crap we've been doing, then there's a good chance oh. that it just got busted in like the new little arc update. What's going on, Crisco? Yeah, I was flying back to base and I ran into this thing and it scared the crap out of me. Yeah, that's, that, that's showbiz, baby. But I mean, on the upside, this freaking creature right here, this Rex that we just found right outside of base, is only level 250, but it looks freaking insane. And like, honestly... Dude, it's like a Giga. Is it like a Giga? And look how big it is. I feel like it's... Well, now I got to see how big a Giga is. Because it, it looks that big next to an Anki because the Anki's also five times... It's self... I don't know. I, I will have to get a size thing going at the end of the survival series. Because now you got me curious, you son of a bitch. Oh, well, and he is slowly making it. He doesn't even care we're shooting him. On my screen, he just, I know, he doesn't care at all. It's like, he's so freaking aggro on everything down there. I might just keep up this one strategy of just, of just like parachuting back and forth over the ravine, shooting down on him. It's yeah, pretty gonna... goddamn baller. Yeah, I'm just going to keep hanging off this cliff. He is Seems taking a good them. amount of damage, though, from stuff down there. Ooh, Jesus. Ooh, Ooh I don't like that. Oh, God. Oh, God, Ooh. I swear to God, if he dies. Oh, Jesus Christ, it's going to oh, happen. Oh, Raptor's hitting him. I know the Raptor's hitting him. That's what I'm talking about. Here, start shooting the Raptor. Oh, the Raptor. Yeah, it does it. Shoot the Raptor. Shoot the Raptor. Knock him asleep. The Raptor can't. Ooh, whoo! The Raptor can't survive, Crisco. He must die. I got the Raptor. All right, good. Yeah, I've been spraying the Raptor. I mean, the raptor's actually... Oh, the raptor's is so weak! What is uh, happening? Raptor's Where's dead. the justice? Okay, the raptor's Ooh. dead, but now we gotta really trank that Rex fast as peens. Oh, this is scary as hell. Oh! I went up! Johnny went up! Oh, no, 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 no! I'm, like, stuck on a thing. We're both glitched on each other. No, no, no! no. Oh, God damn it! That was, like, the worst place uh, to die down there, down in the ravine. Oh, my Jesus! Saying like five times, he's like a Giga. He might even be bigger than a Giga. I, he's one thousand percent bigger than a Giga. You are tripping if you think a Giga is five times bigger than T Rex, Chris. Go like, what are you talking about? He might be as big. Oh my, uh, unbelievable! <laughs> <laughs> well, from up here. You drive No, I know, but just to think in general that Gigas are five times bigger than T Rexes is a silly, silly thing to think. Okay, I'm going for my stuff, and I hope he's just going to stay aggro on that raptor, which I also desperately hope is not going to kill him. There's a whole bunch of hope going on right now. Son of a bitch! Come on, man. Just let me, like, get a little bit away. Let me get, get, get stuck in a tree or something, you great big asshole. We're working out. Eh, he still might die. Luckily, you've done a buttload of torpor to him. Thank God. Oh, good, 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 good. I am sweating my balls off up here, but I wasn't using them for anything anyways. Cooking though, man. Cooking. Yeah. Hey, I'm I have like a buttload of darts. Right you just need, you just need to get to me somehow. Okay. He only has 30,000 health left. It's so scary. If he picks a fire with anything down there, we gotta get this dude trank fast. Where are you, Crisco? Oh crap, he's fighting a raptor. No, I'm not again. All right, oh, I'm going down is. the floor. We gotta trank the raptor. Um, I think he's gonna here. kill the raptor, but I'm not chancing it. Yeah, I'm not chancing it. Gotta put the raptor down. 
Oh. It's honestly safer to just tame the Rex on like the ground floor by its feet, because that's where you get to defend it the best. Yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna park Oh my right god, here. he's so bloody! Oh, thank god the raptor died. Sweet, merciful Jesus. There you go, eat the raptor, get your little health There you go, buddy, go on. Eat your meats! What is he doing? Chris, you gotta help me take this guy. He yeah, is a total yeah, yeah. butter butter. Come here. I think he ate it, but it barely granted him any health at all. Come on. We're too early in the survival series for a fails episode. It's not right! I see him, I see him, here we go. How could you not see him this whole time? He's Godzilla sized. Oh I'm no, in. balls. Another, I'm lighting him up, I'm lighting another him up. raptor is now at his feet. No raptors go away. My poor harps can't take anymore. Shoot the raptor, shoot the raptor, shoot the raptor. Okay, okay. Oh no, the Rex is gonna die! No! Buddy is too pretty to die! Oh my god! I can't handle the heart I'm trying to get the raptor. <gasps> Did it die? Oh my god! I guess fail episodes happen. You can't necessarily predict how your day is going to go on our survival evolved. No, especially Scorched Earth, man. This place is rough anyway. And five times, I want to say. You're right, man. Yeah. You're five times yeah. right. I mean, I don't know. I mean, we did get the craziest, fastest mo moss I've ever seen. You're damn right about that. We have a good way to get transportation now across the whole world. That is pretty beneficial right there. I just would have loved to have that, and I still can't get my stuff because this raptor is on drugs, evidently. Yeah, I'm gonna go down there and deal with this raptor for you. Try to aggro him onto my moth. There we go. A target he'll truly never be able to capture. Well, I was gonna go down there with my Deodon and just wreck him. That's probably a much better plan. I just look beautiful right now. Oh my god, the movement speed on these things is just preposterous. No, 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 no. My moth is not. What is happening? Moths, moths five times faster is a scary concept, bro. Come on! Oh, look at Chris go down there handling the schmeat. He has been avenged. Handling the schmeat? I can't believe that just happened, though. I mean, yeah. actually, you know what? I necessarily could a thousand percent believe it just happened. No! No! Oh, no! Oh. I've got it! I've got my stuff! Sweet happy days! Oh, thank you, God. That's all I wanted right there. All right, well, that was a hell of a fail episode right there, but we keep diversity, you know? We didn't just fail the snakes the whole time. We, we sprinkled some Rex failure at the end there on it, too, because we're professionals, and professionals have standards. Oh, yours looks hella cool, too. It's got, like, a red face and, like, white feet. Ooh, and they're mandibles. I guess giant moths are hella pretty and deserve some uh, appreciation. You're totally yeah, right. Man. That's right. what we should have done. We just go around and get the like, mantra juice on everything. I'm honestly unable to crap my pants right now. I don't know what's happening. Where's the poop? Where's the dookie, bro? Yeah, there's like an yeah. issue. Like, I don't think they have their moth power right now anyways. So I guess it's good we didn't, because we couldn't have. Dude, I think spiky mouthpieces are terrifying. Jesus Christ, I didn't even realize they had spikes under their mouth. That's where their mouth is. Holy crap, I've never seen a mouth mouth. Oh, it opens, oh my God. I've never seen the moth mouth. Yeah, you never seen a moth mouth? Well, not, not in this game. Have you ever seen like the under the spike? It's, it's gross. Like, they're actually a horrifying, terrible monster, these guys. Hey, is that... Am I not doing the juice right now? No, you definitely did it. I'm just stupid. Yeah, you're notably crapping your pants right now. These things are actually epic as hell. Look at its Mine. mouth, though. Did you see its mouth under its flangible? Oh, my God. That's so terrible. Oh, I just noticed that. I've never actually looked at a, my mantra's mouth. Right? Well, they've never been this big before. Dude. Oh. Well, I guess that moth are a mod, but still, like, that's disgusting. Like, imagine being sucked up in there, thinking it's a moth, you're gonna be fine. Then, boom, no, it's a horrible monster. All right, everyone, well, then this is a perfect freaking place to wrap today's episode up. Make sure to drop those name suggestions for both of these lovely moths. Check out the Froggy Man, of course. Leave a like, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Peace!